Hey everyone, just a real quick update on the robot. Um, I've upgraded the belts and pulleys on Joint 3 to be HTD series belts and pulleys. Um, the HTD series has a curved tooth profile and uh, this setup is, you know, has twice as many teeth as the previous L series belt. Um, this is, you know, kind of an upgrade that I've been wanting to do for a while. Um, you know, previously I had access to uh, the low cost XL and L series belts and pulleys and, you know, given the goal has always been to keep the cost down, I stuck with those for quite a while, but um, I do have a good supply on these HTD belts and uh, the pulleys and uh, so this shouldn't affect the uh, price of the robot kits. The, uh, you know, the HTD belt has better engagement, you know, less slip or backlash and shouldn't require as much tension as the L series. Um, so, you know, I'm always working on ways to improve the project, so I'm excited about getting this out there. Um, I've released a new version of the manual. There's just a couple steps that change slightly in the assembly order for installing the pulleys. And then uh, also, if you missed it, in the previous update, I've added a chapter on PLC communication. So the robot can now talk to multiple controllers for interfacing with, you know, a variety of devices. So you can check that out if you get a chance, and I'll put a link to that video in the description. Um, just got these pulleys in last week, so tested them and wanted to get this update out to everybody as soon as possible. Um, I've got a belt upgrade kit in the web store, so if you want to upgrade a uh, previously built AR4 uh, to this setup, that's all ready to go. So, um, yeah, that's it. So, uh, reach out to me if you have any questions about the project. My email address is info at anonrobotics.com, and you can also find that on the contact page on the website, and there'll be a link to that. Uh, below also. So thanks a lot. Bye.